that brings me to the next question for you, which is obviously going through the program. Uh, you're not an amateur. You're not trying to get into cybersecurity. Yeah? You're already working in this space. So how does this program is helping you? Because it's it's interesting. Yeah, we we talked about uh, we talked a lot about how someone uh, entering this market how can we help. But well, what about someone accomplished your, like yourself? How does it help you? So for me, I'm really big on planning and goals and things of that nature. So I have, when I mentor someone, we actually establish what that plan is. And then we call, I do something called reverse engineering your goals to actually set a pathway to what you want to do. When I did that for my own self, it was what do I want to do to now become, I want to do more leadership. I want to be in a C type of role, right? I want to be CTO, uh, CSO, things of that nature. So what are the things that I need to accomplish? Um, one, I knew I needed to develop more of my soft skills, right? And I think uh, formal education actually does help in that area, right? Of, of saying, hey, a lot of times when you're really technical, and I've caught myself, you're, you'll be just, you're full-fledged, just right in the middle of it. Everything is technical, everything is technical. But you have to understand that someone probably doesn't understand what the heck you're talking about, right? There, there are times when I'm speaking and you start talking and, and you're like, oh, my God, what is this? I'm like, I don't know what you're talking about. So you need to learn how to take that same, um, take those skills and be able to converse it from now to your low-level analyst to your CTO, right? And that's kind of some of the things that we're starting to learn how to do in that, in that aspect. Also, I need the masters to compete in that, in that area, right? And you're not going to get calls for jobs at DC level type organizations without the years of experience and the degrees that show that you have the discipline to complete, complete things. So that's really what it is for me. And I'm going to learn things, right? You, you're always learning. The one thing you can never stop doing, and I think James really hit that on the head, was you can't stop learning in this industry, especially things change every day. I mean, I learned something new today when I was actually working. I didn't think you could do something today, right? And some hacker taught me that you can do something today. So I now have to go back and understand that and like, why did this person do this? And what else can I learn from this, right? Because now that person is giving me a blueprint to learn something new. What else could be done with this type of knowledge that I know? 